There are a lot of different ways to catch a redfish on soft plastic, but we're going to talk about the easiest way to do it. And that's basically the same setup that you're going to use with a live shrimp, four horsemen popping cork. You're going to have about a two, two and a half foot leader. And instead of putting a live shrimp on your jig head, you're going to put a gulp on your jig head. And the reason why you're going to use a gulp or any scented bait is redfish are attracted to that scent much more so than a speckled trout. Speckled trout's looking for action, they're looking for color, they're looking for different things like that. Sometimes as fishermen we overthink things and we try to make stuff too complicated and people always talk about what, what color soft plastic do I need to use? Speckled trout didn't matter. For redfish folks, I'm just telling you, it doesn't matter. As long as you use a scented bait, I would tell you clean water, dirty water, the most consistent thing you can use is chartreuse. You can use a blackened chartreuse too, but as long as it's scented, a, a pearl and chartreuse, all of those work.